Rhonda, yep. are we headed home? No, we have about six more days to go before we get to go home. We're leaving Rickwood Cavern State, State Park, Park in mm -hmm. Alabama. So now our next camping is Monte Santo State Park mm -hmm. up near Huntsville, right Alabama. And we have a stop planned on the way there. Talk to you later. Park office, trails and cabins, camping, everything. Here's the railroad. Still looks like winter time up here. It does, doesn't it? There's no leaves. Monte Sano State Park has over 2,000 acres on the top slopes of the Monte Sano Mountain which overlooks Huntsville, Alabama. We enjoyed our stay there. The views of the city were great, as are the sunsets. The park has hiking and biking trails for all levels. Besides the normal campground amenities, there is a Japanese garden area that was wonderful, and the Van Braum Planetarium and Observatory. We're walking on this trail that we think is going to come up right behind our camping spot. Hi! <laughs> North Alabama Japanese Garden. Yeah, they got some pretty bamboo. Pretty. Indeed. Are they haikus? <laughs> Morning yoga, a yellow daisy turns towards the sun. I love the bamboo. But this is a different kind than what we have. Here she goes, in the hammock. Touching the ground? Oh, you're a couple feet away. That's good. My favorite part of the day. Huntsville became the first incorporated town in Alabama in 1811. It was the capital of Alabama until 1820. During those early years, it was a cotton trading center as it had railroad access. In 1941, it was chosen as the site for several military research and manufacturing plants. Just before the United States government entered World War II, Huntsville Arsenal was constructed adjacent to the city to manufacture and store chemical warfare artillery shells, poisons like mustard gas. A few months later, another plant was constructed to assemble explosives for the shells. During the peak of World War II production, the two arsenals employed over 20,000 people. Around the same time, Huntsville became the center for military rocket research. In 1950, Werner von Braun, the German rocket scientist, and his research team were moved to Huntsville. Dr. von Braun and his team transformed Huntsville, Alabama, known in the 1950s as the watercress capital of the world, into a technology center known as Rocket City. Today it is home to the second largest research park in the United States and the U.S. Space and Rocket Center and its world-class educational program, Space Camp. The University of Alabama at Huntsville, with its strong engineering department, works with the Cummings Research Park, which is home to 285 companies with a combined workforce of 25,000 employees. Companies located at the park range from aerospace and defense firms to telecommunications and biotechnology. He hit the target. Dr. von Braun was the leading figure in the development of rocket technology in Germany, where he helped design and develop the V-2 rocket, which was used to bomb London during World War II. Following the war, he was secretly moved to the United States, along with about 1,600 other German scientists and engineers as part of Operation Paperclip. 
He worked for the United States Army, where he developed the rockets that launched the United States' first space satellite. His group was assimilated into NASA, where he served as director of the newly formed Marshall Space Flight Center and as chief architect of the Saturn V launch vehicle that propelled the Apollo spacecraft to the moon. The center is now involved in almost every aspect of NASA technology. More than we spend today, so it's, it's, um, you, can, uh, you can take that for what it's worth. If you look carefully at this chart, you'll see that there was a lot of stuff that happened until the Apollo era, until 1975 or so, and then there was a big gap. And there were no missions actually to the moon, even though it's our nearest neighbor in um, the 1980s uh, and until the middle of the 1990s. Thanks for watching. We really like this park and Huntsville. Our next video will be on Cathedral Caverns, which was great. Subscribe to follow along. Bloopers following next. Here we are at Monte Santo. It's, yeah, Monte. Monte Santo State so. Park. Santi. Monte Santi. Mono Santi. I don't want Joe's doing with his hand. Oh, here he is. We're looking to make sure. We're going to start this over. Monte Sano. Hey, Joe, what are you doing?